find that value of p for which the quadri equation p plus 1 into x square minus 6 times p plus 1 into x plus 3 into p plus 9 equals 0 and p is not minus 1 has equal roots. So here they told the roots are equal. Roots are equal. So b square minus 4ac equals 0. So if you will compare with the standard one, ax square plus bx plus c. So the value of a is clearly the coefficient of x square p plus 1. b is minus 6 into p plus 1. c is 3 into p plus 9. Now, if we substitute in the formula, b square minus 4ac equals 0. The value of b is minus 6 into p plus 1 whole square. 4 into a is p plus 1. And c is 3 into c is 3 into p plus 9 equals 0. So here equals 0. So now here 6 square is 36 into p plus 1 whole square. 4 into 3 12. 12 into p plus 1 into p plus 9 equals 0. Now see here in these two terms here I can take 12 common and p plus 1 common. So if I will take 12 into p plus 1 common, here 12 times 3 36, 3 is left and 1 p plus 1 is left. Here 12 and p plus 1 I took common, so minus p plus 9 is left. So here if you will equate this p plus 1 equals 0, p equals minus 1, they told this is not the answer. Because if p is minus 1, so, minus 1 plus 1 is 0 here in the question. There will be no x square term because coefficient of x square will become 0. So, p equals minus 1 is not the solution. So, I will simplify this part here. Here now, we will simplify 3 into p, 3p, 3 into 1, 3, minus p minus 9 equals 0, 2p minus 6 equals 0, 2p equals 6 p equals 3. The value of p is 3. And in the question at the end, they told hence, find the roots of the equation. So first find out the equation. 3 plus 1 x square minus 6 into 3 plus 1 into x plus 3 into 3 plus 9 equals 0. So, 4x square, 6 into 4, 24, 24x, and here, 9 plus 3 is 12, 12 into 3, 36. So, now I need to factorize this. So, if I take this equation, I will take 4 common here. So, x square minus 6x. 4 times 9, 36. So the equation is x square minus 6x plus 9 equals 0 by 4. 0 by 4 is 0. So just I'll write 0. Now I need to factorize this. I'll split the middle term factorization. So 9 factors are like 3 times 3. So minus 3x minus 3x plus 9. In the first two terms, x if I'll take common, x minus 3. In the next two terms, minus 3, if I will take common, I will be left with x minus 3. x minus 3, again, if I will take common, x minus 3 into x minus 3 equals 0. So, x minus 3 equals 0. Again, x minus 3 equals 0. So, x equals 3. x equals 3. See, if you will observe, here roots are equal. So, they told to factorize, find the roots. So that's why we need to tell the value of x. We need to solve x for x. So x equals 3, x equals 3. You can write roots are equal.